Hi loves, what's up? In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys what I'm eating today. It's all gonna be high carb and low fat because that's blah, 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 blah. That is what I am doing lately. I've been doing it for like over a week now and I've really been liking it. Um, I'm trying to do that. Obviously might have some cheat days with some avocado rolls, we'll see. But um, yeah, I've really been liking it because I get to eat so much and you feel so full, but you're really not eating as many calories as you would be because there's no fat in it. So you don't need to worry about anything if that's, if your goal is to lose weight or you don't want to gain any more weight and you just want to stay the same. You're literally eating all that you want and you don't need to worry about overeating because you're not going to overeat on potatoes because I'm pretty sure you're going to be really full um, if you eat too many potatoes. So I don't think that's going to happen. And bananas, I eat a lot of bananas anyways and a lot of fruit. So that's basically what I do. I've been really inspired by the girl Melissa Alexandria. She's been doing lots of um, uh, easy low calorie density meals which is gonna be this video today. Low calorie density meals so they make you feel really full but they're low calories even though I'm not counting the calories since there's no fat in it it's just all high carbs. The vegan carbs there's not that many it's not that many calories because you know potato you're gonna feel full off like say two potatoes or three potatoes and that's not that many calories so you get full really fast and you get to eat as much as you want and it's great anyways enough of that if you guys want to learn more about it go check out her channel and watch her videos as well it's really good and she has some good informational videos about it as well i can link some stuff down below um anyways let's get started with the video <laughs> my smoothies so much thicker and nicer so I can eat it out of a bowl. So I'm gonna make a tea. I just ate my breakfast outside and it's actually kind of chilly. So I am craving a warm tea. Um, I really like green tea and matcha. So I got this one, it's like a mix of matcha and green. So they give you like five different ones to try. And it's actually, they're really nice. So I think I'm gonna have the mint matcha green. So I'm going to make my lunch. I just went on a 10k bike ride with my dad um, and now I am going to make some collard green wraps. So I have a bunch of collard greens and I'm kind of just going to wrap everything I make into it like kind of like a little wrap and then eat it like that. But a lot of the leaves are like broken, so I have to only, I'm only using like three leaves. So we have a bowl of brown rice here. And I'm going to add some chickpeas to this. So I think about that much. I'm going to cut up some tomato. And we're gonna like kind of fry this up and then put it all in the wrap. I'm also snacking on a little bit of carrot sticks throughout the day, just like here and there. Just want to let you guys know that. We're going to add some corn. So we're going to add some edamame. Edamame is so good. It's I love adding this to salads, um, but it's a little icy, so hopefully it doesn't make it all like wet. Kale, it's kind of welty. I've kind of had it for like a week now. So I'm just going to add this into the stir fry because you can't really tell how like wealthy it is when you just fry it all up. 
So I'm fine with that. Okay, so I just put this on here with medium heat and we're gonna add some spices. So I'm gonna add some garlic powder, so good. Love the garlic. And some chopped dehydrated onion, some sea salt, black pepper, fresh chili flakes. Let's add some kale to this. I don't think we're gonna add all the kale just because it's so much. Okay, here's our big bowl, looking good, looking hot. <laughs> and we have our Swiss chard. I just washed it, it's organic. Um, so we are just gonna put all this in it and wrap it up, we'll see how this goes. Some, um, red beet and cabbage on top, some kraut. So this is gonna keep me full for so long because there's so many carbs and protein and veggies, and especially the greens, we love that. And we're gonna take some of this. This stuff is so good. Put that on top. Okay, so this made me two bowls of pasta. I'm gonna take one to work and I'll save one for tomorrow. I added some spinach a little bit after as well just so it could sit in it while it's hot. And I'm going to add some nutritional yeast to this one because this one didn't work. So good. So well, I'm working tonight three to nine. So I made some pasta that I'm gonna bring there and eat around maybe dinner time. Um, and I'm gonna bring some pineapple and grapes. Um, after that, I might eat when I come home. Most probably will. I'll see what I eat though. See how hungry I am. Um, but yeah, I have an hour till I go in, so I don't know if I'm gonna eat anything right now. I'm pretty full from the wraps. I'm just having a snack before work, just a peach and some blueberries. I am just drinking some nighttime tea before I go to bed. Um, I got home from work and had a slice of watermelon and I'm just gonna drink this tea and that will be it I'm gonna go to bed Hi guys. I was thinking a lot like um, Whoever's in the high carb low fat vegan um, Community do you guys have cheat days once in a while or how does it work for you guys because I know I will be going out to eat sometimes and maybe having like sushi rolls and whatnot like with avocado um, or if you want to get vegan desserts once in a while for a cheat day, do you guys do that? Comment down below if you guys do or do not. Um, I think in moderation it should be okay, but uh, I don't know how other people find on it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you want to see more recipes like this and videos like this. Don't forget to follow my Instagram as well. Um, and you can see what I'm doing on there. I'll post videos and pictures of my food once in a while and all that. So stay tuned for the next video. Bye.